When it comes to friendship, there are deeds and there are words. Concerns about the business climate have grown in recent years with foreign business confronting a more complex regulatory environment and questioning how welcome they are. The answer for some is not welcome enough. A raft of regulation, one thing seen putting U.S. firms off China. China's national security laws on cyberspace and the Internet, another, those potentially hitting foreign tech companies. And to add more strain to these high-level talks in Beijing, there's the macro backdrop. There may be chatter around the impact, obviously, of what is still believed to be a very, very uh, undervalued yuan, and whether that's actually having an effect on the uh, Chinese economy and the global economy, or whether, much like uh, Europe and Japan, for example, they can simply export their problems elsewhere. China says it's committed to welcoming foreign business, but the U.S. isn't alone in its grievance. European firms also complain of promises to open up markets made, but not met. What the membership tells us basically that they see a stronger disconnect between reform commitments and actually uh, actions in order to uh, move forward. And that's possibly adding to the pessimism. Its survey shows 47% of European companies plan to expand in China. Three years ago, that figure was 86%.